Today we'll look at the post view torque strategy found in the Atlas Copco Power Focus 4000. In a typical tightening strategy, we control torque and monitor angle or the degrees of rotation after reaching the snug point of the fasted joint. Post view torque allows us to monitor torque before we reach the snug point. In other words, we're able to monitor how the joint comes together. This feature provides us with a way to catch the failure conditions that might not be found with torque control or even angle monitoring. Let's see how it works. When running post view torque in a fastening operation, once the rundown complete point is reached, the Power Focus 4000 will look back at two intervals. The first interval is the max torque interval. A torque level is specified for this interval, and if that torque level is exceeded, the fastening will fail on the post view torque. The second interval is the min torque interval. Similar to the max torque interval, a torque level is specified for the min torque. In this case, if the torque passes below the min torque level, the fastening will fail on post view torque. By using the min and max intervals in post view torque to monitor the rundown portion of the fastening, we have the ability to catch failure conditions that may otherwise go undetected. In this example, we have screws being driven into a plastic test block. There are two different sizes of screws, but both have similar torque and angle characteristics. Here we're running basic torque control and angle monitoring, first with the smaller screw, and then with the larger screw. Now we'll add post view torque to the fastening strategy. With the smaller screw, the curve passes between the min and max post view limits. When running the larger screw, it is detected by the post view max torque window, and the fastening is added with a post view failure. If we change our post view strategy to accept a larger screw, it now passes the post view test. When the smaller screw is run, it is detected by the post view min torque limit and the fastening is ended.